Hello, today I'm going to show you how to draw this 64 star tetrahedron. First we'll create the circular grid. Select the ellipse tool and draw a large circle in the center of the artboard. Next open the stroke panel, choose the align stroke to center option and set the corner to round join. Let's create a copy, ensuring that the bottom of the copied circle aligns with the center of the original circle. With the copied circle selected, press the letter R for the Rotate tool. While holding down the Alt key, click in the center of the bottom circle to set the rotation point. Change the angle value to 60 and then click Copy. Now press the Ctrl and D keys four times to create additional copies. Select everything, then change the stroke color to light gray. Let's lock this layer, create a new layer and change the stroke color to black. Next we'll create these radial lines. Select the pen tool and draw a straight vertical line from the center to this anchor point. Switch to the direct selection tool, select the bottom anchor point and extend the line. Let's create one more line from this intersection to this one. Select both lines, then press the R key for the rotate tool. Now hit enter on your keyboard to open the dialog box. Leave the angle as it is and then click copy. Now press Ctrl D to make one more copy. Let's lock this layer and create a new layer. Next we will draw this polygon. Switch to the pen tool and create straight lines starting at this anchor point. Finish at the starting point to close the path. Lock this layer and create a new layer. Next we'll draw these two triangles. Start at this anchor point. Create the second triangle starting at this anchor point. Next we will draw these two medium triangles. Start the first triangle at this intersection. And the second triangle at this intersection. Next we'll draw these two small triangles. Let's start the first triangle from this intersection. And the second one from this intersection. Let's lock this layer and create a new layer. Next we'll create these two large triangles. Start at this anchor point. And draw the second triangle starting at this anchor point. Create a new layer and lock the layer below it. Next we will create this shape. Start at this intersection.
select this new shape and then press the letter R for the rotate tool. Press enter, leave the angle as it is and then click copy. Now press Ctrl D to make one more copy. Lock this layer and create a new layer. Next we will draw these short lines. Switch to the pen tool and draw a line from this anchor point to this one. Select the line and then press the letter R to activate the rotate tool. Holding down the ALT key click in the center to set the rotation point. Leave the angle as it is and then click copy. Now press Ctrl D four times to make more copies. Let's create a new layer and lock the layer below it. Select the pen tool again. Finally we will draw these six lines. First line from this anchor point to this one. Second line from this anchor point to that one. Third line from this anchor point to this one. Fourth line from this anchor point to this one. Draw the fifth line from this anchor point to this one. And the final line from this anchor point to this one. Turn off the visibility of the circular grid and unlock all layers. If you wish, select everything and increase the stroke weight. Finally, let's check if everything is properly aligned. If necessary, adjust the position. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.